Up on that side, and again, you keep the energy. Yep, a little good. A little more bend. Yep, that's it. Bend a little down and in. Yes, yes, like that. Good, good. This is better. Yeah, yeah, but that's fine. And then start to decrease the circle again. You then give the bending, and is it easy to turn? Yep, good, good, like that. Then bring the forehand around. Yep, yep. This is better. Come in a little smaller, and in, in, in. And you keep it good, keep it tracking straight because eventually, yes, we'll go to a haunches in, but I want it to be on your turn and you decide, right? Not, yeah, there. And then if you want a tracking straight on the six meter circle, you can get a tracking straight on the six meter circle. Yeah, yeah, good. In the forehand, yeah, yeah, good, good. And now into, into the walk. And I want to do the same way you did the other side. So into the walk, haunches in in the walk, and then you make it a little quicker. Yeah, yeah. Good, yeah, and bending, get it fixed a little bit in your hand. Yeah, and, and as you do it in the walk, it gives you a chance to think about how you're sitting in the saddle, how you, where your weight is, right? <coughs> yeah, that she's not getting you off to one side or the other. Yeah, good, and you can have the moment to, to, to walk you off of her, have the ability to get her a little softer in her head and neck to get how is she in the half walk on the outside if you just touch that right rein, does she come in a little smaller? But at the same time, as she come in a little smaller, she wanted it to be a little bit more active, a little quicker, right? Yeah, on the half of it, right? Yeah, yeah, good. Gotcha. And outside, yeah, touch on the outside, and then haunches a little bit, yeah. Yeah, a little more, the haunches in again, a little bit more of a trial way of feeling, the haunches in feeling. Yes, yes, that isn't too much, yeah. And a little touch again. Yeah, a little touch again. Yeah, outside, a little touch, yeah. Yeah, even though she kind of overreacts a little bit, right? Yeah. Little touch, yeah, little touch, yeah, little touch. Yes, that's better. Good. Yes, there. Good. And then go a little larger on the circle. Right, and then into the canter. Good. Yeah, this is better. Yeah, good. And then into the canter. Yeah, that's it. Yes. And down and forward. Yeah, and bend in. Yeah, yeah, that's all right. So, so stay here. Yeah, good. That's okay. Yeah, good. And a little round. Yeah, a little round. Good. When you can. Yeah, yeah. Good, 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 super, yeah, yeah, come in a little bit smaller again, Make a little quicker behind, yeah, yeah, good, good, like that, good, and then into the walk, and immediately the haunches in, walk, and yeah, outside, outside, yeah, yeah, like that, that's better, and, and as you do this, again, you set her up so you can really do the half walk on the right side, and make her a little bit more active, yeah, yeah, touch with the whip. Yes, and touch with it a little bit. Yeah, yeah. And again, you know, touch with it, but always be prepared for the consequences. You know she's going to overreact a little bit. So with your hand, you play her a little bit round, or you already are ready with the half off that she stays. You know, it doesn't kind of go forward too big, right? And overreact so much, but little touch. Yeah, yeah. The outside rein. Yeah, little touch in that. And yeah, little touch with the whip and outside rein. Yes, like that. Yeah, there, yeah, like that. Good, good. This is that. Good. And then straighten around the circle and into the canter once again. Good. Yeah. Good. Yeah. And forward. Outside range. Yeah, there. And then start to decrease the circle again. Yeah. And then this time stay in the canter and haunches in. Yeah. Yeah. Half all that side. Yeah. Outside. Yeah. Half all that. Yeah. Little touch. Yes. Yes. Good job. Yeah. Little more haunches over. Just a little touch. Yeah, 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 that's okay, Hunter. Yeah. If you touch you, then, then you're ready to keep it. Yeah, yeah, there, yeah, good. And then straight on the circle again. And a little bit forward from your inside leg. Yep, yeah. yep, yeah. like that. Send a little tongue. Good, there you go. Yeah, and then haunches in again. Yeah, and then, then half all outside and haunches in. And a little touch with the whip again. Yeah, and sit. Yeah, yeah, that's okay. Outside rain. It's the outside rain. Yeah, there. The outside rein has to be able to half also. Outside rein has to be able to turn her a little bit, right? Inside rein gets the get her a little bit better in the bending. Yeah. And now come in a little smaller, a little bit more legular, a little more haunches in from the outside leg. Yeah. Yeah. A little quicker. Yeah. Quicker. Yeah. A little quicker. And turning. And turning. And turning. Yes. And turning. And turning. Good turning. Yeah. Yeah. Keep the haunches in. Yeah. Yeah. Haunches in. Yeah. Yeah. Haunches in. Yeah. And now, yeah, between that, yeah, so between that, between that, you're good. Between that, yes, 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 and out. Good. 
and a bigger, yeah, super. Yeah, but that's the energy, right? This outside hindleg has to be up and under the horse and quickly. Yeah. yeah. 